Hello everybody, it is Barbara Sims. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a, another renovation video here on my channel. Today we are renovating a place that I believe is called Vista Quarry. I don't know how to say that. Um, it is a two bedroom, one bathroom home in Oasis Springs. I wanted to do a bit of a smaller home for this build because it was one of the last videos of my pre-recording that I did and so I just wanted to do a small home so it was quick and easy you know that kind of deal uh yeah so that's that's what I did um this is actually the last voiceover that I have to record which is really really exciting um I'm leaving in like two days <laughs> which is really exciting um if you didn't know I am when you're watching this Actually, I think when this video goes up, I'll be home, but I am going on a camping trip from like August, we leave on the 5th and come back on the 15th, I'm pretty sure. I don't even know when we're going, it's fine. Um, so yeah, all the videos like since like the end of June till like August 20th have been pre-recorded, which is fun. Nah. Um, <laughs> Yeah, I recorded a lot of videos these uh, past few weeks, and I don't even know, like, I, I feel like I'm not going to know what to do with myself uh, when I'm not recording. Like, it's just going to be so weird, um, because I'm so used to recording, like, four videos a day, but it's going to be like, what? What do I do? I, I don't know what to do. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, that's pretty fun. Uh, today is actually my last day of work before I leave, which is really exciting. Um, if you didn't know, I work at a grocery store. It's awful. I'm just saying that if you're looking for a job, don't pick a grocery store. Pro tip, um, I speak from experience. But yeah, today's my last day of work, which I'm super excited about. I only work like a five hour shift and, and I work with my best friend so that's gonna be good uh, yeah my best friend and I work together and uh, so we're both working tonight and so I'm not really that mad about it I think it's gonna be fun so I guess it's okay but oh my goodness I'm just hoping and like praying that things at work like go smoothly today because I worked this will be my third day in a row working and the past two shifts that I've worked have both been super hectic and crazy so let me just break it down for you guys okay so today is Wednesday I worked on Monday I worked from 8 30 a.m. to 12 45 in the afternoon weird shift I know right but basically our grocery store opens at 7 o'clock and so naturally usually there's a cashier who starts at 7 there was no cashier that day who started at 7 so it was just the um, opening supervisor who was there who is actually like the head cashier is who was that day and so I got there and I went on till and I was the only cashier I was the only till open from 8 30 until noon so for three and a half hours, I was the only till, which did not, you know, go well. Uh, and even, I was the only even cashier there until 9.45, and then when that coworker got there, he opened up the self-checkouts. So for an hour and 15 minutes, there was just me, no self-checkout, no other tills, just me. And then once my other coworker got there, the self-checkouts were open, but I was still the only, like, actual till, and it was awful. <laughs> and I didn't even have help until I only had 45 minutes left of my shift, and then it didn't matter anymore. My break was super late, which was really annoying, but I'm, like, honestly kind of used to that at this point. Like, my break's late every shift, so it's, like, not a big deal, but it's still a little frustrating. So that was kind of awful. Uh, <laughs> I mean, it's fine. I survived. Uh, I almost didn't get to go home on time either because they couldn't get anyone to come relieve me to go home. And I was like, guys, I'm not staying. Like, I'm sorry. This morning has been not fun and I'm going home. Uh, so that was good. Good times. Uh, and then yesterday was customer appreciation day so basically where I live literally every grocery store does this 
but the first Tuesday of every month is Customer Appreciation Day, and there's basically this deal where if you spend over $50, you either get 15% off your purchase or 20 times the air miles that you earn, which if you don't know, air miles is like a rewards card um, that they take it at a lot of places, different grocery stores, they do it at Staples and like different hardware stores do it. And basically just for every $20 you spend, you get an air mile point and you can use them to like get money off um, plane tickets and stuff like that. So anyways, <laughs> my grocery store does air miles and so yeah, that's like the deal. And so it's usually very, very busy. Uh, now I worked from 4 until 10.45 p.m. We closed at 11. I don't know why I was there till 10.45, but okay. Um, and so it's really busy, obviously, because we have this deal. And when I first got there, it was fine because we had pretty much every till open. And I wasn't super busy when I first got there for whatever reason. But then, all of a sudden, I got moved onto the express lane and then, like, I had been there for like maybe a little over an hour and then it started getting really, really busy, um, which was really, really stressful. Uh, and I kept forgetting because like there's like a card that we scan to give people the deal and I kept forgetting to give people the deal and one lady got really mad at me. I was like, sorry, I just, oh, oops. But it's hard when you're on the express lane because on the express lane, there's like a 15 item limit. And so most people aren't spending more than $50. So it's like maybe one in every eight customers you get spends over $50. So you're like so used to not worrying about it because no one's spending over $50 that when you do get the one person who spends over $50, you forget. And yeah, the one lady got real mad at me. She was not, not my biggest fan. I was like, sorry. I'm just trying. I'm trying really hard. <laughs> um, so that was fun. And it was super busy. My first break I got on time, but then my second break was like an hour late, which was fun. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, it was just crazy. But we also had three almost shoplifters, which is fun. Uh, they have like undercover loss prevention agents that come to the store sometimes and they just like walk around and pretend to be a customer but really they're looking for shop shoplifters and they like just like walk around for like five hours it's fun times uh and yeah so we had one of them there last night and he caught three people trying to steal it was like over seven hundred dollars worth of groceries and i got to put it all away which was like not fun but you know it's fine we made, we made it happen yeah, it was pretty stressful, uh, and I felt so bad because I was working with one of, like, the newer, uh, girls. She, like, just started less than a month ago, and one of the person was trying to shoplift while he was going through her till, and I didn't, I wasn't there. I was on my break, but she told me what happened, and it sounded, like, really scary, and she was like, I don't know what I would have done if the loss prevention guy wasn't right there, like, because luckily he was, like, standing by her tail so he was like watching what was happening and like intervened when it got really aggressive <laughs> but she's like if he wasn't there what would I have done I don't know uh so yeah it's kind of scary like guys pro tip don't shoplift because it's not fun for me it's not fun think about the person behind the the till who you're stealing from it's not fun and now I'm really worried that, like, because obviously the loss prevention guy has to, like, file reports. And I'm worried that, like, they're going to, like, want me to, like, give a statement. And I'll, and I'll be like, I was on my break. Sorry, fam. Can't help you. Um, but that was fun. Yeah. Don't shoplift. It's, it's the worst. <laughs> That's how my week's been going. Uh, and so today I'm working. Hopefully it won't be so stressful hopefully nothing goes horribly wrong and everything is just okay and, and fun and there's no problems that's what I want I just want a stress-free last shift before I go on vacation thank you very much oh my gosh I keep hiccuping can you guys hear that oh, that's disastrous I just ate some raspberries that's probably why oh my gosh another thing that happened yesterday is we have all of these dark roast coffees that are on sale because they expire on like August 15th or something so they're on sale for like $7.99 regular like 
So they were like 50% off and these people, this couple came in and bought 46 of them through my till. And I was like, okay, I guess. And so I just scanned them through and it was fine and they left, but then they came back to get more. And so, um, like a whole nother cart full, right? Like when they came through my till, they had an entire cart full of coffee and then they came back with another cart full and so they had to tell them to like leave like they were like you can't buy this much like we're allowed to limit your quantity and you can't just like buy our entire supply of coffee sorry um and they were like really mad about it and they tried to get a rain check but then I was like you can't get a rain check because it's like it's only these specific cans with this date that are on sale you know so it was just a mess and I was like really stressed because I was like I don't know I felt like I did something wrong I mean I didn't but I still felt like I did you know what I mean I don't know it was weird it was scary <laughs> uh, I didn't know what to do I didn't know what to do oh my god but whatever yeah fun times do you guys like my work stories because I got a lot of them uh, I really do I just working at a grocery store man it's eventful but it sucks so I still wouldn't recommend it, but like, some exciting stuff happens sometimes, you know? Good times. Uh, I'm so excited for this night to be over. Like, you guys have no idea. And then tomorrow, I'm packing and like getting ready. I'm honestly probably not even going to start packing until Friday. We leave on Saturday, but you know, it's fine. I'm the queen of procrastination, would you expect? Uh, so tomorrow I'm just gonna kind of finish prepping my videos, I guess, and, um, hopefully I'll have everything, like, scheduled to be uploaded tomorrow. That would be good. That would be grand. I really hope <laughs> that I'm able to do that, to make that happen. Um, I've been scheduling so many videos. I have so many videos scheduled, you guys. It's crazy. <laughs> Super crazy. But it's okay. It's fine. And I was super stressed out that I wasn't going to get everything finished. Like, I was so stressed about it. But now, I'm like 100% confident that I'm going to have everything done in time. Which is amazing, because usually I don't get things done on time. But apparently, I'm just super on the ball lately. And uh, I got this in the bag. So, it's good times. Uh, I have to go shopping on Thursday. Tomorrow. Oh my gosh, tomorrow I have to go shopping to get, like, stuff. Like, I don't have a swimsuit. We're going camping, and there's, like, apparently, like, a swimming pool there or something. I don't know. I don't swim. I'm very afraid of water, but okay, I guess we're going swimming. So I need to get a swimsuit because I don't have one because I don't swim because I'm afraid of water. I'm hydrophobic as if. Um, so I have to get a swimsuit and sunglasses and, like random stuff it's like an eight hour drive well like it depends on which way we're going but it's either going to be an eight hour drive or a six hour drive to get to the place we're gonna have to leave super early in the morning i'm not excited i don't like driving long distances thank you very much so it's definitely going to be an adventure and a half also i'm not okay well there's no point saying this now because by the time we're seeing this i'm already back but if you notice that I wasn't on social media at all, except for the scheduled videos going up on my YouTube, that's because I was at, um, I was gone camping and not able to go on social media. So yeah, that's what happened. If you were curious, which you probably weren't, but if you were, there's your explanation. I was camping. Uh, I'm gonna have to like make a tweet and be like, hey fam, I'm going camping so I won't be posting. Not that I post on Twitter really anyways, <laughs> but I want to start. That's like when I get back, I want to start posting more on Twitter and stuff like that. So hopefully I can make that happen. But anyways, this renovation is coming to an end now. I really hope that you all enjoyed it. Hope you also enjoyed my ramblings. Probably not, but you know, I try. And um, yeah, thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you have an amazing day and I will see you all in my very next video. Bye guys. <laughs>